So stop looking at me and just listen to me, okay? So put your phone face down and just listen to me as I speak, okay? So today's question is, what is pr prayer? Uh, prayer is communication with God. In our prayers, we talk to God and listen to God. In our prayers, we can talk to God about our problems. Uh, we, thank, we can thank God in our prayers. And we can ask God anything in our prayers. And God will surely uh, give us an answer to our prayers. Prayer can be silent. Uh, prayer can be uh, private or public. Okay. Um, you know, yeah, you can, yeah, you can do either three. You can pray, yeah, you can do either three, right? You can pray, pray in silent, privately or publicly, you know. Um, all prayer must be offered in faith in the name of the Lord Jesus and in the Holy Spirit. Prayer is addressed to God in the name of Christ and through the indwelling spirit for example here's an example of a prayer right so I'm, I'm going to give you an example of a prayer so here here is the prayer father god thank you for waking me up this morning thank you for all the blessings you have given me i also pray for peace and i thank you father god for teaching me so many lessons that will help me to grow spiritually in Jesus' mighty name. So that was an example of a prayer. So first, prayer is addressed to God, okay? We pray, uh, we pray in the Spirit, and we close our prayers in the mighty name of Jesus, okay? Uh, yeah, um, so that's the, that's, that's how, that's how we pray, okay? Um, so prayer is described in the Bible as seeking God's favor, drawing near to God, and kneeling before the Father. The Bible tells us to pray about everything. Everything? Yes, God wants us to talk with Him about everything. How often should we pray? We should keep a running conversation going with God all day long. We can pray under any and all circumstances. Prayer is the Christian's way of communicating with God. We pray to God, we, we pray to praise God and thank Him and tell Him how much we love God. Uh, we pray to enjoy God's presence and tell Him what is going on in our lives. We pray to ask God for something or to ask God questions. We pray to seek guidance and wisdom. Okay, so those are the reasons why we pray. God loves his exchange with his children. Okay? God loves when we uh, speak to him, you know, when we uh, pray to him, you know, God loves this. In our prayers, we must admit that God is greater than we are and ultimately knows what is best in any given situation. God is good and asks us to trust him. In prayer, we say, not my will, but your will, be, but your will will be done. Okay, um, God's will will be done. This is what we say in our prayers. The key to answered prayer is praying according to the will of God uh, and accordance with His word. Prayer is not seeking our will, but seeking to align ourselves with the will of God. The Bible contains many examples of prayer. Okay, so here are those examples. So 1 John chapter 5, verse 14, uh, this is what it says. It says, this is the confidence we have in approaching God, that if we ask anything according to his will, he will hear us. That's the first scripture about prayer. The second scripture about prayer is 1 John chapter 5, verse 15. And it says, and if we know that he hears us, whatever we ask, we know that we have what we asked of him. That's the second scripture about prayer. Now the third scripture about prayer is Ephesians chapter 6, verse 18. And it reads, And pray in spirit on all occasions with all kinds of prayers and requests. 
with this in mind, be alert and always keep in prayer. Or keep on praying for all the Lord's people. That was the third scripture about prayer, Ephesians chapter 6, verse 18. Now the fourth and final scripture about prayer is, is Jeremiah chapter 29, verse 12. And it says, Then you will call on me and come and pray to me and I will listen to you. That is Jeremiah chapter 29, verse 12. And that is the fourth and final scripture about prayer. Okay. So those were four Bible scriptures on prayer. Okay. God's people, we must pray daily. Okay. We have to pray daily. Daily. Talk to God about your problems, your feelings, um, and listen to God for guidance and wisdom. Okay. We must pray daily. Okay. As believers. Okay. We must talk to God. Okay. So if you have, you know, problems, maybe, um, I don't know what your problems are. You know what your problems are. But make sure, you know, you, you voice your problems to God. You know, let, let God know all of your problems. Okay. In prayer. Okay. Tell God all about how you're feeling. You know, I don't know how you're feeling, but you know. Tell God all about how you're feeling in prayer. You know. Um, maybe if you need healing, tell God this. I need healing. Um, I don't know. Okay. Whatever it is that you need, you know. Tell God this in prayer, okay? And uh, God will surely answer your prayer, okay? So that is the end of this, okay? Uh, so today's uh, lesson was all about prayer um, and what prayer is, okay? Um, so yeah, that's the end of that. Uh, so yeah, um, God bless every living soul that will see this.